I believe everybody, disabled or not, deserves a chance to make something of themselves. What I'm looking for as an employer is somebody who's motivated to work. It's really important that people with disabilities are given the chance to work because they are so dedicated and they love their jobs and they love coming to work. People have a choice of where they're going to spend their money. It could be for price, it could be for location or product, but it's also what the company stands for. So it's really important that businesses hire people that reflect the community. It is good business to hire people with disabilities because it strengthens and adds diversity to a team. Clarence is a courtesy clerk here and he sacks customers' groceries and then he takes them out to the car. He just wants to help. He's that giving type person. I'm a bagger. I sweep the stores and the floors up at Food Town. He's self-motivated and has a great work ethic. It tends to rub off on other employees as well. He's worked for our company since 2008. We're very proud and appreciative to have Clarence on our team. Clarence has exceptional customer service skills. He brings a smile to work every day, and he knows more people by name here than I do. Cole is a shining example of somebody who loves his job and loves his work. I like working at Home Depot because I like helping customers. What's unique about Cole is his zest for wanting to figure out things and offer more and be able to solve problems for both customers and associates. We have a Home Depot app where you can look up products and locations and he does not hesitate to assist customers when they come in. He almost knows the entire store like the back of his hand so if I have a question I have no problem going to him and getting the right answer. There's been a few times that we've been out and I've had Cole with me and people will come up and they're like, is that your son? They've told me stories of how I was in Home Depot the other day and he's just such a great worker. I have good friends at work. I can't thank Cole enough for being the guy that he is and the attitude that he brings to the store just makes it enjoyable for everybody. Customers have a lot going on in their lives and their day and they come in here to get help for whatever need it may be and that smile to kind of help them know that we're here to serve and here to take care of them is something that we spend a lot of time training our associates but with Cole it's an automatic every time. He's a great employee and there's not a lot that I have to do other than just encourage him, fill his tank and let him know he's doing a great job. Eric makes a friend out of everybody. Everybody he talks to loves him. I like everybody. The first time I met him, he told me I work all day and I work hard. And that is true. Eric is one of the hardest workers I've ever been around. He does everything with a smile and a positive attitude. He's very positive. He comes into work very high energy. And that energy transfers to our guests and to our employees. That's something that warms my heart to see that Eric has found a second home with his co-workers there at Whataburger. Whataburger is my family. There are so many people in place from the state level to the local level to make sure that each one of our individuals is supported. Employers find out it's an advantage to their business because it makes their customers understand they too are compassionate. After watching Clarence work, I've gone ahead and hired several other people with disabilities and watch them grow with the company as well. You're gonna get an employee that wants to be there. You're gonna get an employee that's gonna show up on time. You're gonna get an employee that's gonna give you 100% every day that they show up. And they're gonna make a positive impact on your company. It's incredibly important for any business to reflect their community and give that individual a chance to show what they can really bring to the table. It's a great opportunity for everyone. No one misses out.